on this problem, we need to determine when are, uh, when are the graphs increasing, or what are the intervals when the graph is increasing, constant, or decreasing. So what we're talking about is we need to be looking at um, you know, when are the values you know, pretty much increasing, constant, or decreasing. So uh, a couple things we look at this graph. This is what we call a piecewise function. And what we have is it's pretty much a combination of multiple functions where each function has its own part, but it's only um, defined for certain constraints. So this graph, which is x plus 3, uh, which looks like this one, is only, oh, this is right here, is only true when x is less than or equal to 0. That's why it's only defined when the x values are less than or equal to 0. That's why I only graphed it here. Uh, the function 3 is only defined between 0 and 2. So you see between these two points. And then we also have another function, 2x plus 1. That's only defined for all values that are greater than or equal to 2. So let's look at this first one. And I look at this graph and I say, all right, well, actually, let's just say, let's just look at increasing. So when we're kind of looking for increasing, we're looking from, you know, when is, um, you know, kind of going from points left to right, when is the rightmost point greater than the leftmost point? Well, you can see if I kind of pick two points from left to right, this point now is greater than uh, this point as far as its, you know, output value. So therefore, this is increasing. Now if I look at these two points, the rightmost value has a greater output, so therefore that's increasing as well. So therefore, this section is increasing, and this section is increasing. So all we need to write to say that is, well, between what intervals? Well, this goes down to negative infinity. So we say negative infinity to 0, the graph is increasing. And then also, from 2 to infinity, the graph is increasing. Then we look at decreasing. So when is the rightmost point less than um, a leftmost point? And there is no graph that would be decreasing that would look like this, where the right, you know, the rightmost point of two points is less than has a, a smaller output than uh, the leftmost point. So there's no decreasing intervals. Last one is we look for a constant, and when we're looking for a constant intervals what we're going to see is, well, between 0 and 2, the graph is constant. Meaning that nothing, you know, there is no change. The points are exactly the same. If you pick two points, their output values are exactly the same. Okay? Any questions on piecewise function? I know piecewise functions are a lot of time confusing. Just treat them as three separate functions that all come together to make one function together. Okay? Last question? No? Yes. Can you explain one more time? I mean, I know how you have the infinity and that kind of stuff, but like, can you just explain how you got the values again? All right. All, if you're looking at, this goes down to negative infinity, right? Uh -huh. So all these values, going all the way down, these, from here all the way down, it keeps on increasing, right? So it's increasing. It's increasing. It's increasing. <laughs> it's increasing. It's increasing. It's increasing. Well, at this point, it stops increasing, right? So it's only increasing from negative infinity to zero. Then it stops increasing. Then it will be like sometimes called like plateaus. Then it goes constant, right? Well, it doesn't go constant forever. It only is constant from zero to two, okay? So you just think of this as like a range. Don't think of this as an order point. It's an interval. From zero to two, it's constant. But then it stops. Then it jumps up to one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Jumps up to six, and then it starts increasing again. Make sense? Yeah, because I, okay. I thought it like, would be increasing going from like, left to right and then going down. Like, do they get increasing first and then the constant? Yeah, you can. Um, but that's more confusing with you're like, going by like, connected top, kind of. Yeah, I maybe, um, I don't know. You can, you know, one thing maybe you want to relate is like the speed of a car. Like, you're accelerating yeah. here, you're getting faster, you're getting faster, you're getting faster. Oh, you see a cop? So you're like, Go steady, same speed, same speed, and then you start going downhill or something, or then like then you pop it into quick gear and jump up to RPM, shoot off. Yeah. You know, I don't know. So, but that's how you evaluate the piecewise function.